in this video I show you how to set image sequence for animation uh, this is very simple processor in Photoshop uh, just follow simple steps as showing my video actually here one thing I have to tell you uh, what am I going to arrange images for animation uh, those images already I have created by using iClone software you can use any software like uh, 3d max Maya uh, cinema 4d or anything that is your wish you can use any software uh, even flash also you can use for 2d animation it's okay fine let's go now main topic what uh, am I showing in this video now start the processor first go to file script and here choose load file into stock here we can use load multiple files and statistics also for same frames arrange but I will explain about this in next video now I will go ahead load files into stock then you can see the power of menu of load layers here choose image frames through browser as showing my video just select all and click on ok then you can see here all those images rename ok that's good now click on ok now go to layer palette and see over here uh, process going on as sequence it is arranging all images exactly on same places this is help to us without any adjustment when we arrange in timeline I like this process very well to create the animation now see here all frames came in layer palette okay so far so good now start the animation in timeline here you can see uh, create a video timeline just click on that but here I don't to want a video timeline so that uh, this one uh, convert into frame animation uh, see the box type of icon here okay now it has just click on that now it has a converter as well just right click on that frame then you can see the timeline set frame uh, choose here 0 0.1 second uh, this is the speed of uh, one frame to another frame now duplicate selected frame and then in layer palette open the eye icon of 17th layer and uh, close the eye icon of 16th layer follow the remaining all frames same processor as showing my video ok fine here I have done all frames whatever is there in layer palette now play the animation and see what will happen I think speed is slow so set the speed time first select all frames and then right click and change it no delay ok and then beside the convert timeline you can see the looping option just change it to forever now play the animation wow very nice if you want save this file into gif 
then just press ctrl alt shift s save for web device and save it gif as well uh, otherwise uh, whether you want to save as video then go to file export render video then you can see the render video setting format h264 uh, that is mp4 and uh, document size 1200 675 and frame per second is 30 it's okay all of my default setting is fine uh, name of video horse run you can see here above select folder okay that's fine now render it then you will get it in mp4 format and next video also i will bring something new tricks for beginners i'm making a lot of video step by step to learn all tools i will post as soon as uh, just subscribe my video thank you for watching my video bye bye